Hello, everybody, and welcome back to baseball here on youtube.com slash Seanosaurus Rex or twitch.tv slash Seanosaurus Rex, where some people are watching right now. Thanks, everybody, for watching. I appreciate it very much. Uh, subscribe to the channels if you can. Uh, if you have Amazon Prime, you have a free Twitch Prime sub or Prime Gaming sub or whatever the heck it's called. I'm so out of date doing Twitch record or Twitch streams that I don't know what it's called. Uh, so if you have Amazon Prime, you have a free Prime Gaming sub that you can use on your favorite channel. If it was me, it'd be great. Please remember to set a reminder in your phone. Every 30 days, you have to renew it manually because uh, it, Twitch doesn't want you to just get free money. They want you to be active on their platform. So, yeah, if you hate, hate Jeff Bezos like I do, take money from him and put it in my pocket. How's that sound? Or sub for free on YouTube, whatever floats your boat. Either way, I appreciate you watching. So thanks for hanging out. Ah, the show. Why did you do that? We're going to jump into some Diamond Dynasty, which I tried to make this video earlier, but unfortunately, and it looks like my hair's all getting all weird. Um, unfortunately, I was trying to do a Diamond Dynasty video and the servers went down for maintenance, so that was kind of uh, unfun. I can't believe how what a wall of sound that sounds like. So let's jump in here. I have created a team called the Preston Spittin' Llamas. I created uh, like a color code uniform. I guess I thought I would be able to do more, but I wasn't. And then I was trying to do this. Welcome to Diamond Dynasty. Next. There's your squad. You do this, and then you complete the moments. You get stubs and XP to do stuff and do things. And then we're going to play the New York Yankees in the bottom of the ninth. Game tied. Bases loaded. You got to knock in the go-ahead run and take home the win. So that's what we have to do. And will you build your thing? I'm just going to poke around, see if there's anything interesting happening. Conquest mode, or maybe the challenges are kind of fun. Who knows? Oh, you know what I need to do? Switch to this. Win one game. Win a game. Kid Griffey Jr. My squad will have, like, a lot of maybe unfairly good players because I bought the deluxe pack. The pitch. Ah, slider on the outside. Oh, that got him! And this ball game is over. <laughs> it got him on his back foot that was out of frame, and I got, I got it. Okay, we did it. All right, there you are. Ooh, universal. I don't, I don't like the way that Kiwi looks. I don't like it at all. Who? Robin Yunt. I thought that said yogurt. Okay. Post game, you get XP um, and the rewards. You can track progress and that stuff. Okay. And then you complete your first collection. Okay. Let's go to the collection now. Press LB. Uh, what? What is happening? It's, a do it's doing it for me. All right. Collections. Press A. Starter collections. Starter group. Bam. Bam. Description. Your first collection. Collect the following cards to complete your collection. Uh, oh my goodness. Next. Items used become non-sellable. Press start. Yes. Okay. Collection complete. We got it. We did it. Boom. Nailed it. Now we're back here. Customize my squad. My squad. Diamond Dynasty squad. Press A. Okay. All right. Oh, secondary position. Fully customize your squad. Press A to replace your shortstop. Oh, you did that for me. Oh... Well, I guess we can use him. Uh, that's wild. It's his secondary position, and he's technically the better player. Okay. Select. Okay, let's head on on the field. But I, my other guy was better. What's happening now? Oh, we're back here. Get three outs to win the game. Oh, we get 500 XP for opening a pack of cards. Let's go. Also, it's like, hey, would you like to just beat up the Yankees for a little bit? 
How's that sound? Do not give up one run, win one game. Okay. Who's our pitcher? Oh, good. Juan Soto. Excellent. Who do we have? Matt Stram? And he deals. And immediately pumps in a strike to the left handed hitter. As a pitcher, you oh, God. Okay, well, I will be honest. I regret the all-white uniforms because I can't see where the ball want. They want the ball to go. I can't see anything. This was such a good idea. Oh, God. In the air, fairly deep to right field. Brings it in, and there's one down. Labor Torres up to hit. Second baseman. Ball, that's low. A one run lead here at the top of the night. And that's in for a strike. Uh, these outfits were horrible. This was a horrible idea. Yeah. Big that. strike. And he really sells the change up with that arm action. One down, base is empty. That ball is foul, and the pressure is building. Ripped to short. I forgot how that worked. Tosses to first. Somehow it wasn't Fine the worst pitch in the world, out. and we're okay. So it's their last <laughs> chance in this okay, here we go. Judge you want a sinker? Play. Outfield deep yeah. here, trying to prevent anything over their heads. Two down, nobody on. Steer act. Two. The Yankees down to their final strike. And Boom! Spitting llamas win. It's game. almost like it's programmed, so you feel good. We got 76 XP. You achieved new rewards. Let's go. Maybe. Okay. Oh, exit. And open a pack. Congrats, you have earned a new pack. Let's open it now. Press LB to navigate to the collect tab. You got it. I'll pretend like I understand what's happening. I got it. Inventory. Yeah, I got it. I know. It's my packs. Press A. Oh, look at that. Let's open up your reward pack. Who do we have? Who do we have? Oh, there we go. Oh, God. Really? A Houston trash tro? Gross. I guess he's gold. Ugh, he's like the best guy I have. I hate it. Oh, okay. There you go. Promoted. Alright. Is that it? If you're looking for some of the best rewards in the game, you should check out Programs. Programs are loaded with missions, moments, and challenges that reward XP and help you progress in the next reward path. Acquiring XP will unlock rewards at the amount listed in the program. Okay. Oh, I have 10,000 XP earned. This is the end of the tutorial. Okay. A pack, a thousand stubs. Ballin' is a habit. One point one five million XP. Then every thirty thousand after that, it's just a a loop. Season ends in 84 days. Whee! Is there anybody, like, worth going for? I feel like I end up with a bunch of this stuff just because I play, like, every day with the, with the Mariner stuff, but... Okay. Uh, so there's that. There's that. Other programs. Starter. Spring Breakout earned Dylan Cruz. So what's the, where's the, okay, so we have single player modes, play versus CPU, mini seasons, conquest, showdown, multiplayer mode, there's ranked, battle royale, events, play versus friends, casual. Let's do, uh, showdown, oh, J-Rod, what, how do I get Julio Rodriguez, hello, excuse me? May I have Julio, please, on my team? He's very cool. AL East. Oh.
So if you play on the top difficulty, you get a 0.37% chance at a diamond. That's, that's absurd. Hmm. Okay, well, we won't worry about that. Let's do, uh, let's try Conquest. Welcome to Conquest, a fan favorite single player mode in Diamond Dynasty. Your goal is to dominate the map by taking over all territories by playing short three inning games against the CPU. As you win more games, you gain control over the map. Maps come in all shapes and sizes with rewards, XP, exclusive items, and hidden treasure. It's a great way to earn packs with player items to build a strong lineup or customize the look of your Diamond Dynasty squad as you find bat skins and other unlockable items. Ooh, bat to skin. start, try playing one of the smaller maps. As you get more familiar with the mode, take on the larger maps. If you're wondering how do I win or finish a conquest map, really important, press Y to see your goals. Complete all of these by mastering the four phases of conquest, attack, steal, reinforce, and move. Okay, what did any of those modes mean? All right, let's do batter up one. Attack phase. There are three ways to attack. The first is attacking an empty territory. Starting at your stronghold, move around the map. Press A to attack your fans, which are represented by numbers in the hexagons. You can attack bordering territories until you run out of fans in this turn. When you attack an enemy territory, you can choose to play or simulate that game. If you have more fans than your enemy, you will also increase your chances of winning a simulated game. Let's talk about attacking strongholds, a critical goal, and these are the toughest conquest territories to capture from opposing teams. You can see strongholds are highlighted with team logos. When attacking or defending strongholds, you must play a three inning game, but here's where it gets interesting. To play easier games, just outnumber the CPU with fans, and if you do, you will see easier game difficulty options appear in the matchup menu. Most importantly, win the game to take over the enemy's stronghold. Okay. Okay, so... Toggle map view. Conquer 13 territories by moving to any open hex during attack phase. Okay, I did it. As your empire expands on the map, you will need reinforcements to strengthen your position and make your territories harder to steal. The good news during every turn, you will receive one fan for every three territories you control. Be strategic as you place them on the map. For example, if you're about to attack, add them to your enemy strongholds or perhaps fortify your own strongholds as enemies close in. Just note that unconnected territories cannot be reinforced. What? Oh, acquire 21 million fans by adding reinforcements. Okay, I'll pretend that I understood that. Move phase, you can reposition your fans on gotcha. the map. Once per turn, use the move phase to your advantage. Set up your forces for an advance, or let's say you feel worried about a nearby enemy. Select one territory of fans to move and bring them closer to home to improve your defensive numbers. Just remember, you will always need to leave one fan in each territory. You can skip any conquest phase by pressing the menu button and advance to the next phase. Use the restart map option if you don't like how things are going at any point. The map will reset, except for any hidden rewards you discovered or rewards you earned by completing goals. Those can only be earned once. To recap, complete a conquest map by capturing all strongholds on the map and by completing all of your goals. Good luck. Select a highlighted territory. Okay.
Oh, I have to play that. Difficulties are set at a rolling scale based on the fan distribution. If you have a large fan advantage, you'll have access to easier difficulties like Rookie and Veteran. However, if you're at a large fan disadvantage, only harder difficulties like Hall of Fame and Legend will appear. Because we can go All-Star. That's what I've been playing on so far. Show theme. Sure. Tarek like Derek. Fine. We're learning Conquest, everybody. into the ballpark happy to have you with us diamond dynasty baseball coming your way on the show it's the ligers and the milwaukee brewers oh good art hmm. really wanted to make like i had a whole logo and a whole pitch coming your way next it's gonna make a design it was gonna be cool i guess it's probably good that it didn't let me do that because i would have used a bunch down. of time to the left fielder, not have Oscar Hernandez. what's it called I wouldn't have a video because the server is disconnected. 98 on a fastball, four seam, a 97 mile an hour, two seam fastball, circle change, slider, 12 6 curve. Not close with that one. Uh, and we're underway here this afternoon. Whoa, Next pitch is downstairs. Not sure why my headphones right turned off, deals. but all right. A big swing and a miss. Well, he came right at him right there, challenged him with the 2 0 fastball. Not sure exactly what he was looking for, but I'd imagine that's a confidence. Oh, that was it. You're in that I mean, it wasn't the pitch, but it was a good one. 2 2 now. Fuck. All day, I've been struggling with the. Here's Royce Lewis. 95 mile an hour fastball. Gross. Not wanting anything over their heads. Breaking ball inside. And that is ball one. Way high. No fight. Oh my god. Oh my god, this fastball. Contreras makes the grab. And that quick. I have to make the adjustment. I have to be going for digging in now. There's a swing and a miss. Tired or not, he's oh, relentless with the way he pitches. He might be exhausted out there, but his stuff is still nasty. And that one God. is lifted in the air. We not again. I like another. Makes the grab. And Ugh. that'll do okay. it. Okay, got to adjust to the fastball and work everything else off of that. Damn it. This isn't what I want. Bottom of the first. Up now for Milwaukee. Christian Yellow. And a pitch. Off the mark there. Oh. And it's one and this is inside. Okay, that's, that's exactly what I want to see. And here it comes. That one's spoiled, and the count now two and one. And a swing and a miss there. They can live up in the zone all game if hitters will chase it. That's just too much velocity. Got him on the bottom of that zone. zone. Let's go. Zone with a curve for strike three. So digging in, Jackson Chorio. First pitch swinging. 0 oh and 1. It just seems weird that you would want to play games on easier difficulties just for rewards. Because then wouldn't you be like more in a mode to be like swings through that one out in front that time. Oh, I don't have anybody up at the pen. I forgot about the three innings. Hold on. Oops, didn't want to didn't want to replay. Hold on, sorry. Nope, didn't want to substitute bullpen. One down, base is empty. Got him swinging. Yeah. Couldn't catch up to the heater. 
And now it's William Contreras. First pitch misses. Just off the outside edge. Really? Looks really sharp at the start of this one. This is how it's going to be today. It's going to be a tough one for this lineup. Two outs, bases empty. Out to center. Junior Griffey's got it. it end to end the inning. That's what we want to see. Second inning set to go. Here's the center fielder, Ken Griffey Jr. Woodruff back to work. That's outside. And that's ball one. Go oh, get out of here, ball. Get out of here, ball. Get out of here. That's a home run. His power with That's his what we're looking for, up. Kate Griffey Jr. Let's go. Digging in, Robin Yell. Right through there That's for fine. A Pull it back. No big deal. To see a laid-off home run in an inning, kind of gets the offense fired up, and you start to expect a big inning. Smooth. God, nice slider. Oh God, his power is 29. If you're on the mound, you just want to expand the zone right now. Get a swing and miss, and get through this at bat. A one two. He oh, swings and gross. hits a fly ball. Center field. Chorio on his way over. Grabs it on the run. And there's one down. And here is Cal Raleigh. Well, our timing's getting better on that fastball. That's and a bad first offering is foul Of course, I say that, and as soon as I say that, it's. In he had a game with two home runs and six RBIs. 12 6 curve absolutely fell off the table that. right there. <laughs> Sean fell one. apart. Stop it. Stop it. There's a strike of the knees. All ones that count. Rip to third, but handled, and that'll end the inning. Damn. Well, at least uh, Griffey came through for me. Weird shot that everything is on the left hand side. Bottom half of inning number two, and the batter now is Reese Hoskins. The wind of the pitch. Right through there for his. Uh, why, why is replay the first? Why? Everything's all wrong. Okay, here we go. We're in a new pitcher here. This is the guy that they just gave me. I hate him. Late in the ball game. Some of them are just wired different, so we'll see what he's got here. Oh, God. A little better there. Forcing fastball in. Too slow. Let's run that one again. Too fast. Literally need to split the difference, huh? There it was. Okay. A little early on that and left, but it's all good. Swing and a miss as he was that did not feel like it was a good pitch. Slider right there. I'll, I'll take it. That's a low end fastball for some pitchers. That one missed. Man, oh man, I don't know how you take that pitch. That's as close as it gets. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. Slider got him for strike three. Willie Adamas stands in. And he takes one right on the black. It's 0 1. Holding on to a one run lead. No, no, Joss, you yuck. Swing and a oh, miss. Dude. He was late. Strike two. Next Whoa, pitch is outside. 
Let's go four seam fastball low and away. Gets a piece. That was neither it's low nor one. away. One down, base is empty. Keeps the at bat going with a foul ball. Hey. Swing and a miss, and he struck him out. Got him. And there's two away. Got him. And here comes the power hitting catcher, Gary Sanchez. Just oh missed. my goodness. Sanchez, Come on, you're killing me over old, here. And he was born in the Dominican Republic. Out in front with the swing, and that is strike oh, one. Right. Two outs. Hey. Swings through that one for strike one two. Two strike. Got him looking. And he hey, thanks for watching that go by. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. We're back to start the third, and there's a new arm on the mound, Colby Milner. Pretty tight game, so they're looking for quality pitches out of him right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. Now batting Max Kepler. The pitch. Oh, God, not a submarine. Milner uh. pulls up the zone, forces contact, so not a huge strikeout guy, but he's going to make the hitters beat him. Doesn't Boy, issue a lot of walks, so the pressure is really on the batter to make something happen. And oh, you. Oh, God. The strikes guy gets contact, and not always great contact. Fuck! Got me with a goddamn slur. Fuck! Come on, Jazz. Jazz Chisholm Jr. Now. That was right on the money just too early. Command in the zone is such a crucial part of it, right? You know, it's not just throwing strikes, but it's throwing quality strikes. And it's having quality misses as well. What's a quality miss? Missing just off the plate rather than over the plate. One down, base is empty. So a foul ball makes it one and two. Damn, you can see the difference there between the the slurve and the sinker. Very early on one, pitch. late on the other. And he got me with a slurve again. Back to the top of the lineup. Here's the left fielder, Teoscar Hernandez. Went down on strikes his first time through. Damn it. A foul ball. Well, he gave up on that pitch early, and it ended up staying in the zone. I'm sure he's kicking himself and would like that pitch again. Ball one. And it's even up. I love that pitch again. Can I have that pitch again, please? Please? Bounce to the Damn right it. side. Fires over Got to first. It. And Hernandez is out. And it's a 1-2-3 inning. Back here in Milwaukee. A new pitcher in the game, Matt Strong. Oh boy, this is a well, problem. To to I'm going lefty, right, left. So this game is so my on the plan. mind's going to be all backwards. Can wrap it up here. We can do it. We can knock this out. We got it. The game's going to be really nice to get you into it, and then it's going to crush all your hopes and dreams. There we go. There we go. The pitch. God oh, dang outside. it. Come on. 
And fouled off. Trying to keep good speed off the bases. Looking to get the tying run on base. And another ball. Mm. Oh, an interesting situation. One swing, you can tie up the ball game. But if you're patient and work a walk, then you bring the game-winning run to the plate. And the pitch. Spoils that one, and it remains 2-2. Two two. Guys, fastball is not going anywhere near where I want it to go. I threw three fastballs on the corner. They were all dead set to the middle. Gross. And that one fouled off. Trying to close out a one-run lead here in the last half of the third. I hate it. I hate this pitcher. I hate him. I, I hate him. Get away from my team, please. Your fastball is garbage. Kicks and deals. Ball one there. The only adjustment he needs to make is his target. If you aim at the outside corner, that slider's going to end up way off the plate. Perhaps look a little more down the middle. And got him. And they're down to their last out. God, that was only two outs. Oh, this is taking forever to get this team taken care of. Swing and a miss. Going one. Going one. Swing and a ball popped up. And that'll fall for a base hit. And that turns the lineup over. Always feels amazing. God damn it. It's another fucking fastball that's not where it's supposed to be. Stats. But the way defenders track down balls these days, I mean, both from the infield and in the outfield, they're really runner on the goal. Swing and a miss. Low throw and a kid to get out. Nice. Save in second. Save my ass. He steals the bag. The Brewers down to their final strike. Swing and a pop off in foul ground. Ball game. Okay. So we're able to take they care of it. That wasn't great. You, but that definitely but we, we figured out a way. Game. That often can be all you I think need. we're and starting to see like a ginormous problem. I am very bad offensively. Very, very bad offensively. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby. Thanks for joining us. And hey, thank goodness that was a home run from Griffey and not a not anything other than a home run. Fans are final line score. King Griffey Jr. one for one. Tarek like Derek Scooball. All right, we went in three. Good stuff right there. Oh, we got a little bat skin. Universal Pro file icon. Banner. Okay. Goal completed. Con conquer, ugh. conquer the occupied territory by defeating the Milwaukee Brewers in a simulated game. You can also play the game on any difficulty, but not required. Oh, I guess. Okay. That's fine. Expand your empire in the attack phase. When you are done, select the skip phase. Four, four, four reinforcements for Manic. Skip to steal fans. I don't what? Skip to move. Do I go back? Three or four goals completed. Hold on. What's the goal? View goals. Complete the map by conquering all the remaining territories.
Oh, shoot. I didn't want to do that. Okay. Victory. Yes, I did it. I completed that. All goals done. All right. Conquest going well so far. Batter up. Steal fans and capture strongholds. Holds. You got it. So do I skip to steel phase? Let's talk about the steel phase and how it's different from the attack phase. When you attack, you can only invade nearby bordering territories. But when you steal, you can choose your difficulty setting and steal fans from any teams on the map. That's an important strategy that pays off. Well, don't steal fans from the Seattle Mariners. Now to steal a territory, choose an opponent and consider how many fans you want to steal. Here's a pro tip check your goals before making that decision. While playing on harder difficulties rewards you with more stolen fans, you might want to try easier difficulties first. There's, San Diego doesn't have any fans to steal from. Oh. Let's do veteran. I was able to win on all-star, but we're not exactly doing the best. Uh, let's go. We'll go Hudson. We have a decent batting order there. I forgot that I was playing like the actual San Diego Padres. And I was like, that's a lot of Padres on that team. It's because it's the San Diego Padres there, buddy. everybody glad you're with us mlb the show brings you diamond dynasty baseball it's the ligers and the san diego padres spitting llamas let's go i forgot i guess i could just skip that okay all set to go and stepping in is the speedy byron buxton and a pinch Oh, that's not what we're looking for. Late on that slurve. Ah. Alright, come on, Tony. Sinker, slurve, slider. Are you serious? Are you serious? You're going to hit my best player? And there's a knuckleballer out there on the mound. One gone runner at first. And now the DH, Jazz Chisholm Jr. All ones the count. Righty delivers on the ground right side. And there's a hit. Wow, somehow that got all the way through. And a go-ahead run into scoring position. One away. Oh, just a nice job coming through in a pretty high leverage spot right there. All right, Griffey. seen high base hits through the infield. He just kind of rolled over on it a little bit, but sometimes those can find the ball. It's a good take right there. Ken Griffey Jr. in the box here lets that one go for a ball. 
A swing and a ball hit out towards left center field. Could be extra bases. One runs in. Jazz on his horse coming around third. He scores his Boom. And they take a two-run lead. Let's go. That's what we're looking well, for. The bat right there. Guy I love Kicker really Future nice so much. Balance swing on it. And when you can rope one into the gap like that, you're thinking extra bases from the first couple of steps out of the box. Oh, that's a bad swing. The sinker really was... About that one. That ball was up the whole time. This is off the inside, and it's one and one. Just missed. In there at the knees. That is strike two. Everything's been. Man, it's second. That the first pitch was high and it's throwing me off. This one high in the air to left center. No trouble here. Puts it away for the out. And there are two outs. And here's the catcher, Cal Raleigh. Right oh, it went right hit. to him. I was on top of it. To ah, that ends the inning, Fuck. and they limit the damage. Uh, limiting the damage is not what I wanted Stepping to hear. The second baseman, Eddie Diaz. Foul ball there. Well, after putting up a nice inning on offense, got some runs across. This is where you look for the starter to go out there, have a shutdown inning. Don't give that other team any hope. Uh, you just hope that he can get through this inning, get the bats back up there while they're hot. In the air, left field. What a way. Just pulled off of it a little bit right there. That front shoulder coming open instead of staying closed. If he does that, he's going to be able to go up the middle. There we go. With some authority nice pitch inside. Kicks and fires. Well, he didn't like those first two pitches. Now in an 0-2 hole. He's going to have to battle. Hope he gets a mistake. Swing and a miss. And he's down on strikes. Two down. Manny Machado up to the plate. And that's in there at the knees. Two out spaces empty. Next pitch is outside. Swing and a miss. God, I can't figure out the timing on this. Strike hitter right here. The strikeout is not automatic. Too fast. What do you mean too fast? That was... Glacial. Right into the play. Oh, oh my goodness. And they get the out after the ricochet. Hey, thank goodness we got the out after my that? pitcher got knocked unconscious. Thanks. Really happy about that. Welcome back, and we've got a new arm on the mound to start the second. Number 51. Just trying to keep this one close here, and this is where a bullpen can give their players a chance to fight back into the game. Hey, thanks for spelling your name correctly. Here's the shortstop at the play. There are dozens of us. Dozens. The shortstop, Robin Yen. The pitch. On the ground to third. Oh, my God. Fires to first, and very nicely done for the out. Max Kepler at the plate. Really nice job to get your first out of the ball game. Hey. Fastball in for a strike, 0-1. On one. Kepler measures 6 feet 4 inches, 31 years old, usually in the outfield, but today he's starting at first. One down, base is empty. Lifted in the air on the left side. And that should be extra bases. I thought that was a way worse piece of contact than it was. 100% strikeout rate. Get out of here. Stop it. Update that percentage because it's not 100% anymore. Very deep, not wanting anything over their heads. Ball one low. One out and a runner at second. Here at the top of the second. Up the middle, Bogarts. 
in plenty of time to first. Gross. And they get the out. It's off so the end of the bat. Over turns over. Next to hit, Byron Buxton. He's all for one. A strike. Well, I know they've gotten out to an early lead, but you don't want to take these opportunities for granted. With two outs, still lock in with a quality at bat, drive in that run. You may not have another runner in scoring position the rest of this ball game. Here's a 1 1. Late on the oh, fastball. Just so late. These aren't even fast fastballs. I'm just getting absolutely blown apart here. Don't. I didn't swing. Started after the one two pitch. Kind of thought I did actually. No swing. Eric Summers kill with the call. Back down on strikes. And the inning is Fucking over. Fucking God. They're not that fast. They're 95. I should be on that shit. Bottom of the second. Here's the cleanup. Oh. I don't, I really don't want to use Matt Stram again. Kind, kind of hated him, honestly. Pitter for the Padres, Fernando Tatis Jr. Hudson, back to work. I hate Hudson, too. What are we doing? What is your pace, man? This is a guy that grew up in big league clubhouses and it's something that you see throughout the game sons whose fathers also played the majors got him swinging for the strike how was that a okay. how was that a positive quality at bat luis Campusano in there at the knees for a strike base is empty one away bottom half of inning number two I hate it. I just, I hate it. Foul ball left side. He'll see another. Uh, what is his rhythm? And the righty deals. Fights it off. He'll see another. Clearly trying to stay back a little bit longer for that change up as he fouls that fastball back. Three. Swing, Too fast. Swing, that's a strike out. I don't feel like I can go Jake much slower in any sort of rhythm with him. A strike. Next no offering misses. How is that too fast? Shot. I hate him. I hate Daniel Hudson. I want him off my team. He swings and fouls one off. And the right hander deals. Just missed. On the ground to third. I have no idea. I have no fucking idea how slow I'm supposed to go with him. He's awful. Get off my team. I'm playing on an easier difficulty and having a harder time with it. Now the number two hitter, Tony Stone. She was plunked in her first trip to the plate. Yeah, she was. She got hit. The pitch. Just missed. The 1 0. A swing and a miss, and that's strike one. One and one. Pitch misses, and it's two and one. Well, she's so great about hitting the ball the other way. She hits those arms extended. So right there, just trying to straighten her up a little bit so she doesn't have as much outside Go, ball, go. Coverage. Go. Sizes this one up, brings it in. And there's one away. And the batter now, Jazz Chisholm Jr. One for one with a single and a run scored Jazz so far. Chisholm Jr. And ball one. No, Sean. Out there to center. You knew Hazel it was bad. Sizing you fucking idiot. Two down. God damn it. Two outs, base is empty. And here God. is Ken Griffey Jr. God, God damn it. AB. That pitch was that pitch was never coming back over the plate. On the ground. Into the outfield base hit. 
Joey gets on base and keeps it going. A couple of hits in a row for him here. Pull that one right in the direction of the shifted defense, but no one could make a play on it. I mean, that's his approach, and it's probably not changing. And now Teoscar Hernandez. Well, it's a good take. Offering and it just misses. Two outs. That clips the zone. And the count one and one. Wow. Yeah, that makes sense. Ooh, it's fuck. there, and that's a great play. So it's pretty impressive. Now, I can't imagine any save is an easy one. You're holding a small lead on the scoreboard, and you know those hitters are going to give you the best at bats they can. So it's always high stress. Let's okay, we're in a good rhythm with Presley immediately, which is good. Slider is in. I am nailed it. And a pitch. In there at the knees. There's a nice it's strike. Ooh. That was a real bad pitch. Really, really bad. At the belt and fires. Come on. Come on. Got him. That's what we're looking for. Now batting jerks in pro form. Swing and a foul straight back. That one's in there. And the count is 0-2. Swing and a ball lifted to center field. Good Corrales break on the ball, Griffey. Two away. Last chance for the Padres. And now the center fielder, Jose Azucar. First pitch, and that's in for a strike. And fires in a fastball at 95. The Padres down to their final strike. Boom! Got him. Is the ball game. Spitting Llamas winning again. Game, a 2 nothing win can sort of feel like a mini blowout. Nice job to jump ahead and a great job by the pitching staff to shut them out. 2 nothing. your final here in this one. For Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show, I'm John Chomby saying so long. What am I, three for three with Griffey? Knocked home two, had a double, he had a home run in the other game. Let's go. We get two show packs? Hell yeah. Goal completed. After attack face steal, at least one million fans from the Padres by winning a three inning game on rookie or higher. Okay. Okay, so now what? Territory that can be reinforced. Oh, now I attack. Hold on. Oh, 
How did, I, how did that move all eight? Oh, weird. Does it do that every time? There's no reason to, like... Oops. Expand your empire when you're done. Okay. Skip to steal fans. Acquire 45 by adding reinforcements. Conquer 40 territories and advance toward the Padres. Capture the Padres stronghold by winning another three inning game. With your Diamond Dynasty team and completing the map. Okay, how we doing? 45 by adding for conquering more territories. 24 of 40. Uh, so we really, really have to go back and go down here, huh? Okay. Hey, how's it going? So, uh, I think we're good there. I don't necessarily need to steal more fans of theirs. So we can reinforce. Nine reinforcements. Uh, there's 45 million fans. I'm doing pretty good. Thanks for stopping by this stream. Hanging out. Okay. So then... Hold on, this is move fans. I like to move some of these. Let's move a four. Oh. Okay, and we can attack. You won. Okay. Simulated chance to win. You won. Ah, well. I could probably win on All Star. But I guess if I give them all to that yes well here we can go this really moves clumsily I don't like it attack okay so now we can just play it on veteran 21 million to 6 million then we're back in Petco Uh, I guess we can try Robbie Ray. Kind of use trying to use a bunch of different pitchers here. Um, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. I'm trying to find a starting pitcher that I like. I don't love either of the two starting pitchers I've used. Scooball has like a really weird like quick drop on his pinpoint, and the other guy just. Couldn't get into a right, flow with. I feel like this is a game that I like need to take notes on and be like, well, I need to find a different person for that. And 
and a pitch. That's a bad swing. What are we doing? What are we doing? Oh god, you have a slurve. Gross. And that's downstairs and outside. Ooh, he got me. Too early. Yeah, what a surprise. Let's see what's in the 97 mile an hour fastball. Gross. Kind of on it, but a little too far off the end of the bat there. Looked like it was a little bit up. It's a good take. Next that's one. a good take right there. Yeah, that's ball three. There we go. Okay. That'll work. Here's Royce Lewis. That'll work. Well, he tried to nibble right there and just missed his spot. Hitter didn't offer at it. Now he has somebody to worry about over at first. Line drive. And that gets down for a base hit. Lead runner around second. The goal okay. There we go. Third. There we go. I think it's going to help that we went that extra round to like reinforce and give ourselves give ourselves a little bit of an easier um, difficulty. He did a great job staying in there, keeping that front shoulder. That's out. He didn't spin off the ball and hook it foul, which happens. Okay, here we go, Tony. No hits with Tony yet. She got hit, which wasn't great. And here it comes. Oh, Squeeze God. I got to call NLDS uh. four here in 2022 at Petco Park, where the Padres knocked out their rivals, the L.A. Dodgers. The place was just nuts the entire game. Terrific fan support. The pitch. In the air, out towards left center. And it drops in. Okay, just easily. barely got That's enough to drop it in. There we go, Tony. Thank you, Tony. People have attached to hits like that. Blooper, Flair, Duck Snort, Londard, etc. But whatever you want to call it, it's a knot. And those are the ones that will make you smile as a hitter just about every time. Oh, can't pick it up cleanly. No throw. That's an error. Is that going to be an error? Damn it. Stringing them together. That's oh, they're gonna call it a base hit. Let's go. Bases Let's go, Griffey. Bases loaded. Nobody out. Now it's the shortstop, Robin Yell. Oh, right truly a shame right there. On his way in. Got it. Nice grab. Both runners tagging. He'll score on the sack fly. It's I actually thought I pushed that too early. I thought for is. sure that was too early. It's a good time to take a drink. Where the hitter is looking for something up in the zone that he can get his arms extended. What you have to be careful of is that pitch that's hit hard. That gets through. Okay, the now we're doing it. Now we're crushing this team. Let's go. 50% strikeout rate. Why is that the stat that you put up there? Come on. Go the other way and put the ball in play. That's a team at bat right there. Nice job of staying back and letting the ball get deep. Here's Byron Buxton. Good take there. Thought about it. I thought about swinging. Examine Buxton's career trajectory. The thing that really jumps out, the speed and the defense early on. And the 1-0. Swing and a miss as he was late that time. Oh, all the way down to 83. Gross. Two on, one out. That one misses. Yeah, that's ball two. They've got him working a little harder in this first frame than he anticipated. That one not close. And the count's full. Everything's been kind of low on the out, low and on the outside. 
Switch to a contact swing. In the air, center field. Azokar drifts towards it. And he makes the catch. Rounder tags it second. And he's up to third safely with two gone. Pitching change here. Tom Cosgrove. Bringing in the lefty with the left handed hitter coming up to hit. 90 to 95 on a four seam. Oh, God. I hate this per I hate this pitcher. I fucking hate it. Look at those two middle pitches, 77 to 82 and 76 to 81. Gross. Now batting Max Kepler. Gross. Swing. I don't know why I swung at that. I was too late and it was not even close. A mistake, it works out really good for the pitcher. The hitter has timed it up, expects it to be to a certain spot, and it just doesn't get there. Yeah. Fouled off, he was late. Lefty out of the stretch, runners at first nope. and third. Edmonton. Just misses the mark outside the zone. Ground ball right side. Bogarts fields it cleanly. Gathers. Damn it. The first. They uh, the damage her here. ball is awful. Back here in San Diego. Stepping in for Ooh, San Diego. Ha Song Kim. Ha Song Kim. The bugs are back, baby. After a great start, three run lead after their first inning, but so important to be airtight defensively. Don't give away extra outs and allow that other club to get back in this ball game. Strike two. And a swing Boom. And a miss. One down. Hassan Kim has a weird swing. Here is Xander Bogarts. Bogarts. Feels very stiff. Right through there for a strike. Line the other way. That's a fair ball and down the right field line and towards that corner. Batting third. The third baseman. Here's Machado. Hey. Machado. To short could be two. Off balance feed, there's one. And That'll end the first inning. Let's go. That's what we're looking for. Welcome back, and we've got a new arm on the mound to start the second. Number 51. You're a pretty tight game, game, so they're looking for now quality pitches out of them right here. Got to do his best to keep the score right where it is. And the pitch. Darn right to him. On the ground a second. Right Bogart's to him. That was actually a pretty hittable fastball. We were on top down. of it. And now Teoscar Hernandez. Fastball groove right down the middle. Usually a lot of damage done with that pitch. A hard grounder, but he wanted to get that ball in the air. Maybe drive inside it into the gap. Just off the inside edge. Hernandez, 31 years old, and he was born in the Dominican Republic. On its way to the I thought corner. I, I thought I had the PCI on that. And Damn that it. lands in no man's land, a foul ball. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended, tied him up a little bit, slightly up, slightly in. One down, base is empty. Misses oh, outside. Okay. Two okay. and one. He's got to go to that slider at some point. In the air, out to center. Azokar Home. Settles under it. Okay. He makes the grab. He was that slider, and it was a terrible one. It was that was an awful slider. Here's the third baseman, Royce Lewis. Single timing, pretty good, just a little under it. In the air, out towards right center. Azokar under it. Damn it! He's got it. It went higher, and the slider was worse. Come on. Oh, I got to get better about putting people on bottom of the inning. People up in the bullpen. Uh, we'll try Stram, Taking but I don't in, love it. Speedy outfielder Fernando Tatis Jr. Ray back to work. Yeah. That one finds the zone. Oh, Strike right. one. This guy who grew up in big league clubhouses got to be a nice feeling, Siggy. When your father played the big leagues and he passes down 
all that wisdom. Swings and misses on the fastball up in the zone for the strikeout. Now the DH for the Padres. Luis Campusano. That one to first. Kepler. He'll do it himself. Already two out here in the home half good. of inning number two. The catcher. Next for the Kyle. Padres, Kyle Higashioka. On the ground, right side. Stone. There we go, first. Tony. Three up, three down, inning over. Oh, nice. Little, uh... We're going to start the third, and there's a new arm on the mound. Adrian Morahone. Just no, trying to keep this one close here. More home. This is where a bullpen can give their players a chance to fight back into the game. Tony Stone digging in now. Singled and drove in a run her first time through. Way upstairs. A real bad pitch. Ball one. That's down and in. Two balls, no strike. And now the lefty Ball just three. missed. I got three and oh. Now fly ball to right center. Azokar. Go to the alley. Damn it. it I think it's an okay swing. I know you probably want to avoid that on 3 0, but just under it. In the gaps, they practice this, and when the game comes, they make the play perfectly. Why are all these pitches up in the zone? Oh, for the love of God, are you fucking serious? Low, high, high, low. And at least fouled it off. One down, base is empty. Popped up to the left. I hate it. God damn it! Snags it for the second. Fuck! You son of a bitch! Now the shortstop, Robin Young, drove in a run with a sack fly his first time up. That nah, was not a pop up foul at a playoff to the right side that'll find the stands. And yeah, there's a ball. Two down, nobody on. The shortstop takes the ball. Well, he might have to look for a different put away pitch right here, too, too. He's already seen the curveball a couple of times in this at bat, so. Everything on the outside. Okay, at least fouled it off. Two down, nobody on. Fuck, that makes, exact, that makes sense. Three. That's outside. There's a nice walk. One of the things about that two out walk, the base runner over at first base is going to have a very aggressive secondary lead. So bring him in. Circle change, sinker, slider, four seam. Damn it. Sinker's outside. Gets the call from the pen. And he'll one. Ground ball, left side. And foul ball. I think his power is actually reduced from last year. This to center field. Bogarts on his way over. No trouble here. Puts it That's away. That's a really bad, out. really bad so swing there. Why is replay? Is replay? No, it's usually bullpen, right? Or manager at least. Oh my god. Bottom half of the third, and they bring in a new pitcher, Ryan Presley. And I can't imagine any save is an easy one. Now you're holding a small lead on the scoreboard, and you know those hitters are going to give you the best at bats they can. So it's always high stress. Let's see what he's got here to try and close it out. Struggling getting into. The flow here. It's left. Oh god, not this problem. I feel like I'm pulling it right, but just I'm not. There we go. That one was better. 
and he deals. There we go. Maybe overcorrected a touch, but. Next one misses, and that's ball one. Left hand batter waits. That catches the top part of the zone, and that is strike two. Swing and a miss. Boom, strike, strike out. out. One away. Let's go. Now batting jerks and profile. Off the plate inside, and it's one to know. Presley, he's made a name for himself as a very effective reliever, but not really what you expect from a bullpen arm these days because he's not out there racking up K's. Here comes a pitch. So now one and two. I think it's the deception his ability to change arm angles and slots and give hitters different looks within one at bat. They're never able to get comfortable when you only Damn see it. him once. A lot of times he has success. Okay. All right, I got to settle down here. Throwing a lot of the same the stuff. Last half of the third. Oh, I wonder if I can get him with a slider. Grab ball up the middle. Kind of? In time to Kepler, I guess technically that would count. We threw a bunch of slurves down there. The um, so down the and that line. slider is just Jose a little bit the quicker. The next up for the Padres. And first offering is fouled off. Got to be clever, too, when you don't have that lights-out stuff, right? Absolutely. Yeah, you got to know what you're able to do instead of focusing on what that hitter's strength is. Stay with yours. To first, and this should do it. Steps on the bag himself. Ball game. This is just a nice win. Three-nothing ball game. You feel comfortable about the three runs that you score, but you also know that if you're not careful, a bloop, a base hit, and a home run ties everything up. But it was great pitching. Timely hitting really made the difference. A shutout in this one. Three-nothing. There we go. Tony Stone knocks in a run. Raleigh next knocks in a run. Three in the first. Nothing after that. Kind of just a general problem that I've been having with this game. Oh, let's go. Let's go. See what's annoying is you gotta go all the way around. Okay, and that one's it. Oh, actually it works a lot better on the Ah, there we go. Whew. That feels good. So I haven't gotten any, like, secret treasure or anything. Okay, batter up three. Tackle turn-based goals and multiple strongholds. Complete the map to earn the 90s bat skin. Oh. Oh. Go with Tari or Tarek, Tarek Skubal.
from Yankee Stadium in the Bronx. The show brings you Diamond Dynasty Baseball. It's the Ligers going up against the New York Yankees. I uh, keep forgetting that I can skip all of this because right, I don't usually do it in my normal thing. Leading off, Teoscar Hernandez. Teoscar the pitch. Hernandez. That one finds the zone. And with uh, that, we're underway in the Bronx. Fuck, I hate everything. God damn it. Man, that was pretty gross right there. The pitch. Takes it in for the out. Here's Royce Lewis. That swing right there tells me he's seeing the ball pretty well. I know it didn't produce a hit, but he made solid contact, and that's all you're looking to do anytime you're at the plate. Swing and he breaks his. I'm back. so annoyed. Throw it in like a normal out. spot, nice asshole. Start to the afternoon. That's two out. Oh, for third. God's sake! Oh, fuck off. And Stone is and stepping in for the Yankees, Juan Soto. The lefty fires. And immediately pumps in a strike to the left-handed hitter. He's a master at hitting fastballs. You need to be careful with location if you're going to throw him. But why to kick the pitch? Fights that one away, and the count remains 0-2. Swing and a high fly ball out there towards left field. Hernandez makes the play, and there's one down. Here's Glaber Torres. Right through there for a strike. Throughout history, the fastball down has been the most successful pitch. Guys can handle a little bit better these days, but they, of course, still prefer something belt high. There we, the there we go. There we go. Three and a fastball up in the zone. It's Aaron Judge now. Jack swing. No appeal. Ball one. High fly ball out to center field. Griffey gets under it. Makes the yeah. catch. Pretty easy and first that is inning. The inning. All set for the. Start of the inning. Here's the center fielder, Ken Griffey Jr. The wind of the pitch. That one finds the corner. That's strike one. I mean, that's perfect location right on the black. I mean, over and over again, Fuck. this guy demonstrates the ability to hit those spots. They're so tough to do anything with as a hitter. 0 oh, 2 now. Got him. Leadoff man retired here in the second. So digging in, Robin Yen. Also, what was that awful noise? Pitches outside. No score here in the second. A swing and a miss as he chases. Okay, stop. What is that? That is awful. What the fuck is happening? Shut up. Game. Oh my god. Wouldn't chase that time. What makes him special is a lot of pitchers lose movement in their stuff the deeper they go into a game, but he's just different. We hey. see plenty of break in his pitches, even when he's running a little low in the tank. Two outs. And another ball. Next offer, he's in for a strike. Looks like a really good fastball today. You can hear that catcher's mitt pop it. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. And good work there as he... He's not throwing a goddamn runs. thing that's we fucking hit hittable. I hate him. So now the Get him out of this goddamn John game. Right through there for a strike. Late swing, fouled off. 
just missing there. One and two to count. And a swing and a miss. And one away. Anthony Rizzo steps to the plate. Anthony Rizzo. And that one fouled off. And the lefty with the 0-1. Fought off. That wasn't what I wanted at all. One down, base is empty. Got him on the outside out corner. Let's go. Now it's Lemay. We'll go righty, righty. Here comes Ryan Presley to the mound. Now Ryan Presley. Oh my God! Through one pitch, thought I was going to be okay, and then I wasn't. We're back to start the third, and there's a new arm on the mound, Victor Gonzalez. Sinker 97, slider 88, circle change of 90. Come on, got to be low. Out front and foul to the left side. Line drive, base hit. Off to a good start with a leadoff now. I'm sure he feels really good about that one. Off the bat, that one registered at 105 miles per hour, man. That is smoking, and these days you hear it all the time, but the numbers just don't lie. You can drive a ball like that more often than not. It's a good take right there. Max Kepler at the plate now, and that's inside. And another ball. If you're a base runner, you got to stay dialed in here. Look for anything in the dirt. Try your best to get in the scoring position. Ground ball to the right side. Torres. We'll just and take the one. The it's a bad. Third. That's a huge defensive mm, play in the late stages bad of the game. Swing. Oh, God. They brought in the lefty. You've seen today, but it needed to be made. That's helping your team. On the ground at first. Steps on first for the out. Well, there's a lot riding on that at bat right there. Nice job of the pitcher to bear down, make the pitch, get the ground ball. Excellent piece of work. Here's Teoscar Hernandez. He's over one. And there it's 0 1. 0 1's the count. That one out to right. And ah. He's fallen behind in a huge spot. Got to do what it takes to come through. Maybe choke up on the bat a little bit. Spread out those feet. Whatever it takes. Line drive. Base hit. Runner okay. from third into score. There we it's go. Nothing. Switch to the contact swing. Whatever that siren is makes me want to scream. I fucking hate it. Pitcher for the Yankees, Tommy Canely. So two down. Now the third baseman, Royce Lewis. Ball one, no strikes. The kick and the pitch. Runner goes. There's a ball. Jesus. He threw the perfect pitch. He threw the fucking perfect pitch. I can't steal for shit in these games. Bottom half of the third, and they bring in a new pitcher, Ian Jabot. These are the spots where relievers really make a name for themselves, late and close. There's not much margin for error, but at the same time, there's a reason they're put in these situations. Forgot how much I don't actually like that pitch at all. I need you to pitch like a tenth of a second faster. He's like, I'd like you to be a tenth of a second more patient. I can do that. 
wind in the pitch. And that's in for a strike. No need to offer that pitch until you get to two strikes. It's just a low percentage of success when you want to try to go after that down and away pitch. Strike two. Looking to get the tying run on base. That's foul off to the right side. Keeps the A.B. going. Blows Got the him. Let's go. Here's Jose Trevino. Trevino. And fouled off. A one-run lead. And the home team trying to pull it out. Swing and a miss. And it's 0-2. Damn it. Wasted a perfect throw right there. The wind of the pitch. Got him swinging. There we go. So last chance for the Yankees. Alex Verdugo stepping in now for the Yankees. Swing and a miss. Strike one. 0-1. This could end it. That nope. one missed. It's a good take. That's a perfect pitch, and he just, meh. Foul ball still, a one and two count. Right-handed reliever. Fights that one away, still one and two. Wow, that is a generous strike call, but I'll take it. Get me the hell out of here. Every at bat in these three inning games, it's like the playoffs. Sometimes all it takes is one big swing and some great pitching to come away with a quick one to nothing. Took a took a lot of effort for me to get that win. Buxton one for one with a run. Hernandez was one for two with a ribby. We used two outs to like advance him to third. Thankfully, we came through with. Uh, Buxton, or the, sorry, the Teoscar Hernandez. The start of the map, travel directly to the Yankee stronghold and capture the stronghold on the first turn. Restart the map if you've already completed the first turn. Okay. Doing pretty well here. There's like one extra like little fan area that's up in the corner. Like it's Yankees, the Yankees fan or something like that. Go take care of that problem. Hello, baseball fans, and welcome. Diamond Dynasty Baseball coming your way on the show. It's the Ligers taking on the Miami Marlins. Okay. Ready to go now. Here's Teoscar Hernandez. The pitch. Hey. And catches the outside corner. And we're underway. Yeah. Swing and a miss. And fuck strike two. me. What the fuck are you doing? You see and... He guessed wrong right there. Nasty slider with just terrific fight at the end. And a pitch. Here's a high block. I hate it. Ah, uh, damn Here's it. Throw something. Why is that not in the zone? And it's caught for the out. Or low in the Here's zone. Luis Lewis. Ugh. 
First pitch doesn't find the zone. Oh, he never moved because he never had time to. At that kind of velocity, you'd prefer that pitcher work away. Bella finds a corner. One ball, one strike. The 1-1 one -one is fouled off. And another ball. The guy at the plate could recognize slider out of the hand. Didn't stay in the tunnel very long in terms of depth and perception. He yeah, knew at least right stay alive. It was an off-speed pitch. And that one is lifted in the air. De La Cruz pulls it down, and there's two gone. Tony Stone digging in now. In the air, right gonna draw. There we go, Tony. Thought I had so a better read on it there. Keeps it going. Now, no waiting around right there. She was ready to swing it on the first pitch. With the way defenders track down balls these days, I mean, both from the infield and in the outfield, there really aren't a lot of base hits on balls hit like that. But there's always a little room back behind the first and second baseman to drop a long dart in there, and she found a way. God damn it. Fuck. Misses. Yeah, the count one and two. It's a good take. Switch through that one. It's a strikeout. I just ran out of fucking patience. God damn it. Fucking son of a bitch. And the batter will be the shortstop, John Birdie. And here it comes. Lifted in the air, right field. Kind of forgot how much I hate Daniel Hudson. Jazz Chisholm Jr. now. I mean, that is two awful fucking pitches. Hard hit left side. Get him out of the game. I'm, I'm done. I'm done with him. I fucking God, I hate him. Stands in here, leaves that one off the inside. How was that too fast? Good eye in that spot. Fouls one off out of play, back to our left. Swings through that, and it's a strikeout. He might be the most difficult pitcher I've ever tried to use. I, I hate him. I fucking hate him. And welcome back to the ballpark. Now, Robin Young. Paris, back to work. Center field. And there's one away. Stepping in, Cal Raleigh. Do we have four righties? Slapped hard the other way, but foul. One down, base is empty. Just missed. Oh, we had King Griffey Jr., that's right. Sharp grounder, that's through for a base hit. So they get a man aboard with a one-out single. Good the time. Ryan Weathers comes on now. Here's Byron Buxton. Gentlemen, your attention, please. That one is absolutely belted. And it one hops the wall. And he starts his afternoon off right with a double. There we go. Back to back base hits. That's a good sound coming off the bat, man. And as he connected out front and lifted into the outfield, that's one of those swings where you just don't even feel the ball hit the barrel. That's a pure stroke. Left hand hitter waits. There's a strike. Hey. With the go ahead run at third, here at the top of the second. Next offering is down low. I think ultimately you want to tie him up, get the ball in on the plate so that he can't get the barrel to it and hit it to the outfield. 
they're all loaded up. He knew he had a little wiggle room with the open base. Oh, Jazz is a lefty. Oh, damn it. I thought he was a righty. And this inning might really break open. Now at the plate, Jazz Chisholm Jr. Late swing, foul to the left. One out, base is full. And that one fouled off. At the dish, looking to lift the ball in the air in this spot. Anything but the inning, inning double play, Bob. 0 and 2 now. Oh, he Huge fucking painted the corner. And now Teoscar Hernandez. All right, Teoscar, you came up big in the last center. game. And that's outside. Raleigh at third. Buxton on second. Kepler on at first with two down. Swung on, belted. That's back. It's gone. Grand slam. Tay Oscar Hernandez. Let's go. It's four nothing. Absolutely Oscar crushed it. Grand we'll slam. Now the number two hitter, Royce Lewis. He's all for one. Swing Fuck you. And a miss. And it's all one. one. Lewis, in his second season, 24 years old, a former first-round pick. Back in, swung out, belted. Deep. That one went back there, and that one's going to land not so much here, but here. A gigantic blast. It's 5-zip. So up next, Tony Stone. One for one with a single so far. There's your strike. Okay, that's fine. Two out, space is empty. And now the count is even. And strike two. One ball, two strikes. I'm sorry, Tony. This looks like extra bases. Now she turns and heads for second. The throw in. In safely. It's a double and her second hit couple of hits in a row for her here. Smash that one through the infield for the knock. When it's hit that hard, it makes it very tough on the infielders to make any sort of play. And now Ken Griffey Jr. Oh my Late goodness. Runner at second, two down. Can't glove it cleanly. But they get the out of first and that'll Pitcher on here, number 59. And you know, bullpen guys can struggle sometimes when they're called upon with big leads because it just doesn't have the same intensity. Oh as no, so that other we'll guy who's like, oh, it's too fast. Your toughness matters in situations like this as well. Oh, for fuck's sake, this dude sucks. I don't know how you want me to go slower. I don't understand what that means. Too fast. I it's hard to go much slower than that. Oh man, we have some uh, we have some replacements to try and find here. That one's too fast too. Oh my god. And a pitch. That that's just misses. Yeah, oh, of course that's it's one. Burger measures six feet two inches. That's just bad. Two hundred thirty pounds, and they went out and made a trade for him last season. Kicks and deals. There's a strike. I did it, but I don't know. Kind of surprised I was actually able to replicate that. Right hander kicks deals. That's out Jesus. to Jesus. Junior should have this one. And there's one down. And yeah, we have a whole other round of Josh batting Bell to do. The, now. the first baseman. Yeah. 
And yeah. immediately pumps in a strike to the left-handed hitter. This is a very important yeah. inning here. After scoring right. all those runs, you want your pitcher to come out and no just ball, mow them right. down. The offense has worked hard. It's shut down right. inning time. Couldn't there hit we go. the fastball at the knees. Oh. And now, Jesus Sanchez. Yeah. And he takes a strike. Oh. Just missed. One and one. Next pitch inside. Come on. Two and one. Two down, nobody on. Comes up empty. That's strike two. Inside, just missed. Man, how many of these pitches? He finished that really well. Just couldn't get him to offer that. There we go. Thank God that one broke in instead of breaking out. Or I guess broke it out instead of in. Whatever. It hit the edge of the zone. We keep We're dancing around it, driving me nuts. And with the big deficit on the scoreboard, he almost has to just put that out of his mind. Every outing matters for relievers and their numbers, but I think okay. it's tough to get up See for if this we can type get, of appearance uh, the same way you would for one in a close game. Oh my god. They're just leaving them up at the zone, and I'm so committed to the low part. Also, okay, so I need a new second baseman because that guy's terrible. Raleigh at the plate now. That's ball one. Ball one, no strike. And that is in for a strike. And the count one and one. And another ball. Sean, no. Fouls one off. Two and two. No, that can't be what you swing at. And that just misses. Really good take, especially with two strikes. Line drive, short hop to third. Slings it across, oh. out number two. And now Byron Buxton. And one the first oh. pitch misses for ball one. No, I, it was a check swing. Away. It was a strike either way, so it's fine. So late on the 95 mile an hour fastball. On the ah, for a strike. Two down, nobody on. We're here in the top half of inning number three. That's Pitch misses two. there. Ball two. Swing it. He yeah, absolutely fooled me. Catcher has it. Fires the first. That completes the strike. Good God. Terrible. How is Ryan Presley not? Ryan fully warm. Gets the ball now. How is he cold? He's got a nice lead to work now, with, so he should come in throwing in. strikes, attacking these hitters. Here comes a pitch. And a weak ground ball to the left side. And it's off the bag. And they get the out after the ring. Wow. Holy shit. Up for the Marlins. On the ground right side. Takes it himself. Two up, two down. Marlins down to their final out. Now here is Christian Bethencourt. That's a slider for a strike. Right through there for a strike. This guy's pounding the zone. Hitters don't have time to think in between pitches. Swing and a miss, and he got him. Let's go. And do it. Sometimes it takes just getting away from home. Players can sort of come together, connect a little bit more than they do when they're at home with their families, and that can breed to success on the field, as we saw in this game today. Excellent win by this team. Five nothing. Teoscar one for two with a grand slam. Royce Lewis one for two with a solo shot. There we go. Look at us. Earning that XP. Yes. Yes. Packs, baby.
three, six, eight, eleven. You won! Goal completed. Find the hidden reward. Yes. Yes! Hidden reward. Let's go! Let's go. There's that 90s bat skin. Let's freaking go. All right. I don't really want to restart, but okay. Okay. Well, there you go. I did it. I've, I learned the tutorial. Earn TA for the Chapter 1 Team Affinity East Divisions. Central, West. Five goals completed. 18 goals. Nation of Baseball. Batter up. Final lesson. Oh wait, that's what I that's what I already did. My bad, my bad. Nation of baseball, and then there's East, Central, and West. Oh, okay, because it's all of the all the teams. Gotcha, gotcha. Gotcha. Cool. What are the goals? Fifty million. A show pack, show pack, show pack, a headliners pack. Conquer all territories. Wow. Okay. Well, there you go. That's, uh, that's the batter up here inside of Diamond Dynasty. Team's looking pretty good. I think we need to tinker with some of the players. Um, where's the... Customize? Team name? Edit? Oh, you can edit uniforms. Oh, logo editor? Oh, okay. Okay. Uh, where's my players? How do I... Collect? No. Oh, manage squad. The whole button, it's like this. Um, I need a different second baseman. And then we need to work on the bullpen. The bullpen is... Uh, Scooball, I think I feel a little bit better with. I can't stand this, dude. I like it's awful. I hate it. This guy was ha was really rough as well. Oh, that's all right. We'll uh, we'll work it. We'll work it. Okay, main. Is there a way? Is there like a? Yeah, whatever. Actually, you know what? Let's rip some packs to see if we can get a. Uh, see if we can get something going here. Show shop. No. My inventory. Like it is every time. Oh, not my stadiums. My packs. Six team. As I can't say the word. Oh, we got some hooks. Corpus Christi hooks. Oh. Oh. 
Iron Lope. Yeah, we could. We've been. I've been known to use pitcher. Ooh, a gold. Look at that, Milwaukee Brewers trash. Quick sell. Eric Haas? Is he an improvement anywhere? Probably not. Where's who's the cat? Who's my catcher? Oh, Raleigh. Yeah, never mind. New bat. No, thank you. Whew. Yuck. Oh, I guess you could you could do collections if you really wanted to. Rubber ducks. Okay. I don't know why, but I, this photo looks like he posed for like an office party. I don't know. It's very funny. Nathaniel Lowe. Okay, let's see. Add the lineup. Seventy-seven. A little more contact. A little bit more power or uh, contact left. Everything else is not great. Never mind. Yeah, sure. I'll take a hundred coins. We'll rip a couple more packs here. Sea wolves. Again, another just kind of like kind of weird photo. I'd like you to stand there with your arms crossed. At least he smiled, which I appreciate. All right, last pack for the night. I think just garbage. Oh, total owned two. <gasps> Quick sell. Five coins. <gasps> Quick sell. Five coins. Or a hundred coins. Let's go. So then who... Is there anything cool going on in this shop? Buy packs. Got a 10,000 jump start. 50 for 25. 75,000. I got that already. Spring break. break at, bleep, spring breakout. Nike City Connect. Ooh, there you go. I don't know why you would want to buy that, though. Feature items of gold. Hmm. I don't know. I guess I don't get the, the card game stuff. Uh, Achieved rewards. Well, there you go. There's a, there's a look at Conquest. Or at least I guess the tutorial of Conquest. Season 1 starts now. Season 1 packs have already been added to your inventory. Okay. Diamond Dynasty Seasons. Oh. There it is. Okay, here we go. Cornerstone. Oh, shit. I already have a Byron Buxton. Is he better, though? Actually, a super good starting pitcher would probably be really helpful for Conquest mode. I already have Byron Buxton. Okay. Not 
Oh, now we own 15. Well, I guess I gotta open five of these then, huh? Old Hickory sponsorship. $10,000 per home run. Hell yeah. Really? You're gonna really give me a second profile banner? Get out of here. Bruce Bolt, ten thousand dollars per home run. Okay. God, I'm just getting absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. A new bat that I probably already have a better bat than. Ugh. Well, there you go. Didn't really add anything to uh, to the Diamond Dynasty uh, team there, but hey, that is how it goes. Thanks so much for hanging out. Hopefully, you enjoyed uh, this uh, this video. Um, yeah, I'll be posting baseball videos every day, 6 p.m. Pacific time, right here on the channel as we lead up to uh, um, oh God, the regular season. I'm so tired. Um, yeah. Thanks for hanging out. I appreciate it. Kind of a longer one. Just one in conquest mode. Might do, uh, I think I might try my hand at a battle royale, but that sounds like such a bad idea because I am not good at this game. But uh, I don't know. We'll see. Um, yeah, stick around. Watch on uh, twitch.tv slash Rex if you'd like. Thank you for watching YouTube. I appreciate it. Subscribe over here. Watch more baseball over here. Do the thing over here. Watch that stuff. Appreciate it. We'll see you another day in a different video tomorrow night for more baseball. Good sports. Go team. Good night. Bye.